Hey everyone, it's up Earth Collectors here. We're opening up some Prism Football 2020. We have two cello packs, two hanger boxes, and one Walmart mega box. So you've probably seen some of the Target mega boxes. I believe this may be one of the first Walmart mega boxes. Could be wrong on YouTube, but uh, we did find some today. Uh, so we were fortunate enough to find all these varieties. They only had like one or two blasters. So I didn't include that in the video, but we thought at least we'd give you a good sample of what you uh, can find out of these products. Yeah, we got this stuff at a uh, local Meyer here um, and they restocked on a Thursday this week. Uh, but Walmart and Meyer have the same, they both have MJ holdings. So these are technically the Walmart uh, Megas with 40 cards and the green pulsars so first off the cello packs 15 cards inside three card red white and blue bonus packs so we'll get into this uh, we have a rather unconventional camera setup today due to uh some technical <coughs> difficulties ace aka our tripod finally pooped out luke broke it i did not break it all right um we're Maybe going not, to go ahead i just blame them yeah it's my fault we're gonna go ahead and do the red white and blues first so the the rookies are usually on the back of these red, white, and, red, white, and blue packs. Um, so if you're breaking them, just keep that in mind. I'm trying to make this look decent, but yeah, sorry, the the quality may not be quite as good just because of our camera setup. But we still wanted to bring you a video. Damon Arnett for the Raiders rookie. Not the big name you're looking for, but oops. Watch your foot. Sorry, sorry for the earthquake. Um, Let's see what we can pull out of here. Maybe a silver. Um, so if any of you guys who make videos or record stuff, if you have a ring light, that's what we're recording this on, except not the light, just the stand for the light. So Yeah, we're using the uh, stand. A little yep. weird. Um, yeah, so Jimmy Garoppolo, Kawan Short. We've got a green coming up here, Bobby Wagner, and... Rookie. Oh, Ooh. I thought that was going to be uh Yeah, Joe, Joe Burrow, Burrow, but... T. Higgins. T. Higgins is very good. Yep. <clears throat> Green, Deshaun That's Watson. That's cool. Another rookie. Hype and Marlon Davidson. So those cellos at, at Meyer, they're 15 bucks. Uh, yeah. Which is kind of crazy. But I'm uh, thinking at Walmart, they're like 12 But Yeah. Meyer, Meyer usually jacks up the price a little bit on their stuff. But they did have a special going on, so we were able to save a little bit on some of these. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, we found uh, some of these hangers as well today. We found these hangers a couple of times now. They seem to be like the most prevalent of the retail so yeah. far. I don't know um, why, but it seems like by us, hangers, if people are finding stuff, they're finding hangers. Everything else yeah. is hard to find. Uh, the Megas are definitely going to be the hardest if you're looking for this stuff. The Megas just, every year, they're maybe put out six to ten of them in total and that's all you're gonna see at your stores so yeah every year is that's right <clears throat> i mean in order just to get retail period you pretty much have to go either immediately after or when the vendor is yeah. stocking otherwise you, it will be yeah, gone it'll be gone um and you can say what you want to say people should leave a packs or whatever it's just not gonna happen sorry guys um yeah people tend to not leave packs period no period so, yeah because you'll anywhere. never find it again josh yeah, we had a friend who went all over the place and never found anything. That's nice. Yeah, yeah. he went all over the state and find a thing. Uh, LaVisca Chanel Jr. It's just in such high demand. Um, they really should do something. Uh, you know, at, I know some targets have started doing it, but do something with limiting <laughs> limiting at some of these stores even if it's just a you know a put it in a display case, do a couple, do two uh, two items per person per day or something whatever uh that may be just to you know make sure everybody gets it because right now if you leave stuff someone else is going to come along and buy all of it um look at our little knife yeah pretty cute one of my favorite all-time multi-tools right here the little leatherman i don't know what's this thing called wingman or something like that no micra the Leatherman Micra, the Wingman's a bigger one. So these have more cards than the Target Megas. I think the Target Megas have like 24 or something. Someone can let me know. We don't have a Target by us, so. Um, but you get one auto, two Mega Box exclusive base or rookies neon green Pulsar, 10 of the hottest NFL rookies. So 10 rookies in here, which is really, really good. Uh, the hangers, <coughs> you're getting maybe two rookies per. Um, yep. So. And according, according to the advertisement, you're getting the hottest rookies. So we should get Joe Burrow, uh, <laughs> Justin Herbert, 
Uh, you, Tua, you name it, we're going to get them. The hottest one. So yeah, we'll see if that to. advertising is. Goes... Oh, Luke's dropping them. There just goes a PSA out. 10 to a PSA 8. All right. Yeah, I mean, a lot of Prism is a tough grade. This year, the condition on some of these cards, like the centering. I was, Prism centering is always tough, but centering is pretty tough this year again. There's like some weird corner issues sometimes. So, four cards per pack, so we'll get into this and see what it's like. Yeah, the hanger boxes were really bad. I didn't, I didn't notice in that box that No, it was bad, I didn't either, but, but... Some of those hanger boxes, the rookies are all dinged up. Curse, Bruce... A Drew Locke hype and good color, uh, but Kenneth Murray for the Chargers. I don't know what he plays. <clears throat> Linebacker. Yeah, not the right guy. So the problem with the Prism, of course, is if you're buying this at inflated prices, look at what we've gotten so far. I mean, it's not like every pack really has a gold mine in it. Got uh, Marvin Jones. We got an autograph here. Ooh, good color again blue yep it's a silver whoa whoa that's cool that is sick <laughs> that was not what i was expecting at all okay that's pretty cool oh, Willie McGinnis, McGinnis, silver uh, auto. that's pretty sweet whoa. luke is a big patriots fan so yeah that's cool that was not i was expecting like some junky rookie not yeah that. me too so that's interesting um yeah cool and he's definitely William McGinnis, not a um, slouch of a player by all, any stretch of the imagination. Nice. Two Chargers rookies so far, yeah. so hopefully you know we get Josh the other Kelly. the other Charger. All right, all right. So no green um, yeah. autograph. I guess they're not guaranteed to be green. No, In years I past they have. I saw that that there's uh, other you can get the silvers and stuff this year. Devin Asiasi. Um, the rookie checklist is huge. It's super tough to get good rookies. There's a 100-card rookie checklist. Uh, our dog's trying to go underneath our card table, and it's uh, tight. Going to tip uh, it over. Space, so yeah. we're trying to get her to not tip over the camera, preferably. And we got our first green pulsar in here, so let's check this out. Sweet. These things look really cool. I think they started doing this in 20. 18, I believe. Um, maybe 17. 17, they did not. I know for sure. They had Target Mega Boxes where you get the pinks, but they did not have the Walmart. 2018 was the first time we got them at a yeah, Walmart. Yeah, maybe player. it was a, a weird. Patriot box. <laughs> so we got Teddy Bruschi. And AJ Epineza, maybe? I don't know. So the rookies are super tough. Um, I think I have one. I'm not going to give away the back card because that's obviously the rookie. But you still have the chance to get silvers, and I don't think you can get green. We got another green pulsar here. How about a nice rookie? Nope. No. Donald, weird. Yeah, all. weird. All these veterans. And Logan, Logan Wilson. Logan Wilson. What, um, are, do you, are you guaranteed a certain amount of greens? I forget. I think you're guaranteed two. Two? So. Okay. So I think that's that. what it used to be in the past. Um, two. So, well, let's see if uh, we can not knock anything over. Um, so, second half of the mega box, we already got our greens, we got our autograph, but is there or are there any good rookies in here? So, there's Mark Andrews, Elshon Jeffrey, Christian McCaffrey, and then CJ Henderson is our rookie. So, I don't know if he's done much at all. I don't know. I have no clue. Plays on a team where he could potentially get some playing time. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, and players. we just, um, yeah, he, is he in a, um, that's his college uni? Yeah. Yeah, okay. All right. All right. Marlon Mack. And then Jalen Smith. And Jerry Rice. Let's see if this thing will focus. It a won't really better. focus any more yeah. than that. You got to hold the cards back farther. And then Chase Young. So not that's bad. not bad. Chase Young had a big game the other day. He's pretty popular in the hobby, Chase Young. Yeah, for a defensive guy, he's kind of like a Bosa the past couple of years in terms of value and stuff. There's your guy, Justin Tucker. Jay Money. Hit a game winner in the Browns uh, game the other day. There's a fireworks. Those are cool. And then our rookie is going to be Noah. Not even try to say his last name. Something. The rookies, I mean, 
Prism this year, if you want to get more value and you're going to pay retail secondary prices, buy Mosaic, really. I mean, Mosaic yeah. is way less tough in terms of rookies. And yeah, stuff. Prism absolutely. Prism seems way, way harder. And from what we've seen other people rip to, it seems like it, uh, the cards are obviously a little bit more valuable um, if you get them, but it's way easier to get the good guys out of Mosaic. Yeah, no doubt about that. Let's see, here's our next rookie. Yep. Fulton. So, but when you're buying these at retail prices, obviously do not shy away from picking them up because... You know. Yeah, I don't know <laughs> what kind of value we got out of this mega box, that's for sure. But, hey, last pack. There's a silver. A silver, that could be good if it's a rookie. All right, Zach Ertz, let's see, is it a rookie? It's a Raven. It's a Raven, could be. I don't think they have any rookies, really. Well, we got him already, Mark Andrews. We already Andrews. got a silver of him. And Mims. Yeah, not so I'd Pretty say tough. that was a... The autograph was decent, but everything else was totally brutal out of that mega box. But once again, you're paying 50 bucks for Prism with a shot at, you know... Right. $500 that, cards. That is true. So, not bad, but... All right, let's see if one of these could make up for it. I'm going to save the... Whoop, Don't the cello pack for last. We'll do the hanger box next. The cellos seem almost better than the hangers, honestly, from what I've seen. Um, the red ice parallels are super, super tough. And so are the variations, too. The head of variation. Yeah, this, yeah, these hanger boxes are really tough. Yeah, I'd say... Well, yeah, I'd say probably the blasters to me, maybe the the way to go of all of them but maybe the cellos yeah, i don't, know. I don't we, know we have to open up another mega too to see what yeah. the mega would be like too all right so there's the pack try not to show the back because there's usually a rookie in the back let's take it off camera to try to open this thing actually i'm gonna use my little handy dandy scissors Yep, so if you ever need a nice multi-tool, just get the old little mini Leatherman. It is quite handy. I had one, I lost it, and I didn't know what I was going to do. Then I got another one for Christmas it, it, one it, year. It becomes a part of you. It does, totally. Michael Gallup, Butler, Lattimore, Savage, Drake, Tonight is uh, Chargers Raiders. That should be pretty fun to watch. Ooh, you got a silver. Silver. Could be good. Could be. Ooh, there we go. That's not bad. Um, Jacob Eason. So, I think not the, bad. I think the black and white look might have actually hurt the variations values. They really don't carry a ton of value. Um, the big guys do. Yeah. Big, big guys, but. Rookie, you know, silver. Yeah. Hopefully it's LaVisca. Ooh, nice. Ooh, that's not bad. That's really nice, yeah. All right, so this is a pretty good um, hanger box. So I would say it's the best hanger we've ever opened. Yeah. All right, there's that guy. Sammy Watkins, Aeneas Williams, and Noah. <laughs> All right, uh, Jalen Smith, and then Patrick Queen. He's pretty good. Yeah, he is good. Um, Jalen Smith. I mean, a silver LaVisca is like 20 bucks. Maybe. Yeah, not huge, but... That's not a bad pull. To hit a, <laughs> no, hit a rookie silver of a top prospect. I mean, you have, a, you have like a 1 in 400 chance to get the guy you're looking for. You know, <clears throat> it's tough. Let's do the blah, red, white, and blue first here. Oops, almost gave away the rookie if there's one in the back. All right, Cole Beasley. He's been yeah, he's been playing really well. And... Sean Lee, be a good rookie. No. No. <laughs> Jalen Johnson, Chicago Bears. You can just tell if they're not wearing a helmet and it's not going to be who you're looking for. So it says on the outside of the cello pack that you get one rookie per in these, uh, these packs. All right, and it usually seems like it's either a green or a silver in these packs. Yeah, I don't think there is anything else that you can get um, in terms of color. Yeah, they used to throw autographs in here, and now they're not doing that according to the packs. Um, uh, not odds, but whatever they you know tell you you can get. Not a rookie. Melvin Gordon. And 
Russell Wilson fireworks. And last but not least, be somebody good. No. Be somebody good. Travion Diggs. Tough, well, tough, tough. that was tough. I mean, wowzers. Uh, but hey, it was a lot of fun, and by no means are we complaining because we actually found Prism Football. Uh, so, yeah, but uh, I mean, if you if <laughs> if you haven't found a bunch of Prism, don't necessarily be too jealous because it's not. Uh, it's not like pure gold. Yeah, no, it's <clears throat> not. Other years of Prism, I, Prism Football has always kind of been tougher than basketball. Basketball, it seems like it's usually a smaller checklist. Rookies are a little easier to pull. Um, this stuff is not that way. Yeah, as stuff. Of right now. And I kind of wonder if they ran the presses on the stuff. Time will sure, tell. Well, but, I'm sure they made more, but yeah. I don't know. How, I don't think they made a ton more. No, right? no, but... This is the normal amount of retail, but... They may have made more, but who knows. Yeah, it's hard to know. But I think they, they definitely did take some stuff out. Yeah. Um, I know, like, you're not getting one auto or one relic per blaster anymore. They took that yep. out. Um, there are no... Like, in basketball, you get the pulsar, you get a chance at a pulsar, like, a 22 or whatever right, out of the blasters. Right. That's never been in football, but they did not include that yeah, this was, year. Um, the hanger packs, you could get red, white, and blue autos. You cannot get those as far as we know this year. I've not seen any pulled. I haven't seen anywhere that says you can. So I'm assuming you can't. Um, and blasters are the same way. So I don't know. Yeah, We used to get the cello packs and love getting those because we would every once in a while pull one of the red, white, and blue yeah. um, autographs out of there it's, or whatever. And seemed, those are big. Yeah, it seemed like every couple of cello boxes you'd yeah. get one. And they're really tough, so... I don't know. Anyways, let us know what you think. Have you pulled some big cards? I know people have. Uh, obviously, we could open up a one or more pack of this and get something else. But yeah. um, it, it is it is pretty tough. But it is a lot of fun, and it is fun to always find some good retail in your local store. So hopefully you guys are finding some. If so, let us know in the comments below what you found uh, and what you pulled. All right, well, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next break. Um, Stay tuned for more football. We'll be doing some random pack videos of uh, some retail football packs we have, um, as well as any other stuff we can get our hands on um, over the weekend if we can find any more retail. All right, take care, guys. Have fun collecting. We'll see you soon.